to the Northwoods League. If you've gone out to Mayo Field this year, there's a local name that should stick out to you. Former Century Panther standout and current North Carolina Tar Heel Mac Horvath is playing for the Honkers this summer. The 19 year old is tearing it up for the flock, batting 302 with an 855 OPS this season. Julia Mitchell has more with the local star. Game. He singled his last time up. High fly ball in a deep left field. Back goes Aubrey. That's way out of here. It's the return of the Mac in Rochester. It's awesome to be a honker, you know, being back in my hometown, uh, being able to play for people that probably wouldn't be able to see me uh, in person otherwise. The whole community coming out to see Mac Horvath step onto Mayo Field. This time as a honker rather than a Century Panther. When his name gets announced, both for you know the pregame starting lineup and when he's coming up to bat, those cheers are a little bit louder for him. Horvath joining the team after his freshman season at North Carolina, where he hit 227 with 22 RBIs. And the Minnesota kid continues to play with confidence here in the month of May. The hardest thing for me this year was just there's like a little bit of a learning curve because um, I struggled really early on and just being able to uh, deal with that and not give up just kind of keep going at it working every day to be able to overcome it. Now he's hoping to use this summer to improve his game and maybe inspire the community along the way. And I've seen you know kids that have shown up to the games that have had North Carolina Tar Heels stuff on and I just have to imagine that Mac's a part of that influence uh, on them. You're always trying to grow the game in some some way and you know maybe if it's just one person that comes to watch you play and they're the one that takes the next step uh, it is what it is you know you just you just want to inspire kids to be able to do whatever they want to do. The Med City will be behind him all summer, and it should be quite the scene when he hits one out of Mayo Field. I think it'll be pretty electric, yeah. Reporting in Rochester, Julian Mitchell, KTTC Sports.